what's up so over the weekend this past sunday i did a real estate market update walkie in specifically um specific city but i did also cover you know as usual the whole of des moines metro and i pointed out that sold homes i pointed out sold homes was a lagging indicator it showed whatever that happened about 45 to 60 days ago and if you saw it dropped pretty dramatically but i also pointed out pending homes is a future indicator it shows where real estate market activity is heading towards so if you kind of keep track of time which i will show you the, the timeline a little bit more but um right here sold homes 45 to 60 days ago is when the virus first start hitting by um, iowa here and we have kind of reacted towards that and if you see it tanked kind of tanked um kind of showed what the the indicator of what the virus has done to our real estate market activity and then now recent week pending activity went up and um it's it's pointing towards like our turning point or changing point in real estate market activity now i have another piece of information to show you and it strongly supports that and just kind of hopefully this will um, instill some confidence in you um, carrying out your plans and whatnot so let's take a look at that it's showing time chart up here and i have our iowa timeline for the virus down here based on well wikipedia but it's fairly accurate so if you look up here in the chart we were charting pretty strong um, blue line is 2019 orange line is 2020 and we were you know pretty high in terms of showing compared to 2019 now looking down here at the timeline March 3rd was the first um, known cases for Iowa's you know, coronavirus and you see it, you know, it, we are still fairly strong right here and then the week right about a week after is when governor king reynolds announced our emergency that was march 9 you see march 10th was our peak and immediately showing starts to decline now <clears throat> continuing here if you look march 15 is when um, Governor Reynolds announced school closures and if you see March 14, March 15, we bit pretty much right there we started about you know just literally tank no showings nothing show nothing going on and for about like two weeks here um, everything just kind of went quiet um, just to give you like a perspective um, if we just kind of pick right there if we had 60 showings in 2019 we are we are having about none in 2020 that's what the chart is showing so it's kind of putting that in perspective we were pretty quiet about these two weeks and then something happened here which pretty much is buyers or homeowners pretty much kind of thought well looks like this virus is going to be here for a while a lot more realtors uh, real estate professionals lenders um, even the attorneys we all started putting safety measures in place it's kind of protecting everyone involved in a transaction and it looks like you know it's it's taking effect it's telling everyone is giving confidence to everyone to say no you know we can't still carry on with our uh, plans our move our moving plans basically 
So that said, um, you know, virtual showings, virtual um, meetings and everything start taking place a lot more. Um, and then now you can see over the past oh, week or so, past two weeks or so here, um, showing starts to pick back up. And as of yesterday, we were really, really close to 2019's average. Um, so that said, it is ties, this basically ties in line to our pending home sales, um, basically a future indicator showing that real estate activity is picking back up comparing to last year's activity is fairly close right now. People have a lot more confidence in the market um, and a lot more confidence in real estate professionals to actually have good safety measures in place to help with um, the entire process. So I hope this helps kind of show you where we are at and if you had plans with um, your real estate transactions, you know, probably is a good time to start reaching out to real estate professionals, to realtors, to lenders, and just kind of see where you are at, see if you're comfortable with um, all the safety measures in place, and you know, might be a good time to start carrying on with your plans. So, hope this helps you. Feel free to let me know if you have any questions. Be glad to answer them and uh, hope this will instill more confidence in your real estate needs. See ya!